John Bridge, I'm an architect, welcome to the studio. Today we're going to talk about our residential experience and starting with Mark Jacob Barn with the Don't Move Improve scenario. This was an extension to an existing barn, creating a lovely open plan living space to the rear of the existing house, flowing in from the lounge to the dining and kitchen space and that lovely view to the garden all accentuated by the height of the space with the mono pitch and clerestory light there that allows the space to flow nicely and those views in and out of the garden really exaggerated by the sliding doors that go open from one corner this brings that inside outside feel to a project that our clients really adore and it provides a much exciting party atmosphere when the family are over and friends are around to see the house which is an overall house remodel and this was improving curb appeal from the front to an exciting extension to the back with a bedroom pot and this provides a also view of the garden with a mono pitch glazed roof and a really fantastic contemporary kitchen to a private farm orangery which doesn't compromise on that view in and out of the garden by an open expanse of glass with triple glazing so you have that real dynamic garden view in and out of the lounge. So as well as our domestic range we're now developing a specialism in eco homes too and this really does embrace our passion for environmental design with 21st century living standards and this has been manifested through Greencroft the first that we did it two the custom dwellings over in Rain Hill they're both on site now being built out of structural insulated panels, SIP, as well as a basement out of New Jura, which is ICF, to then an amazing new eco commune over in Broughton in Preston, the first of its kind. Nine individual dwellings, all designed with a different aspect to them, all encapsulating the good of what we know from our domestic architecture with open plan living space vaulted ceiling heights, that inside outside feel from the living space, all with south facing roofs to capitalise on solar PV, an eco design drainage system and also ecological improvements around the site that really do harmoniously bring the project to its environment. To a private dwelling over in Guzna which is a large contemporary dwelling replacing an existing bungalow and how we've brought down individual elements of the property and given its own style. And this is embracing the inside outside feel too, from the aluminium framed gables to the individual aspects of how each space overlooks the front and back of the site, providing a contemporary garage and living space with balcony also over the rear garden as well as a private dwelling in Fullwood which really does capitalise every inch of the site and replace an existing bungalow we've then gone down into a sub-level garage and patio with a turntable that you can spin your car around and go back up in forward gear to a private balcony on the first floor and southern aspect for solar PV and thermal this really does push the boundaries and improve upon the quality of design of the area and we're really looking forward to seeing it on site. So as well as the domestic architecture and new build eco homes, we're also specialising in compact living too, such as the Black Barn project. In this instance, imagine you have an existing shed or a garage on your land, like our client did here. And what we're offering is a replacement eco holiday home which really does utilise every inch of the site and every single part of that space is being utilised for a holiday experience. It connects the inside to the outside through the use of sliding folding doors and we've also got a wonderful mezzanine space internally too so we're really embracing that compact living which is also as part of environmental design as much as the insulation. So hopefully you share our enthusiasm and the energy for environmental design. And if you want to talk about this more, we offer a free 30 minute consultation. So get in touch and we'll see you in the studio.